my name is Shana Kamubaka and for today's video, I want to share to you on how to draw a parabola, how to find its vertex, the focus, the reflex, and the lattice structure. So, why do you mean parabola? So, parabola is a curve where any point is at an equal distance from a fixed point, the focus, and a fixed straight line, which is the direct. So, we have a two equations here, which is the x minus h squared is equal to 4p y minus k. y minus k squared is equal to 4p x minus h. In regards of this equation, we have a vertex. So, what do you mean vertex? Vertex is a point where the axis of symmetry crosses the parabola. So, focus is a fixed point on the interior of the parabola that is used for the formal definition of the curve. Always remember that the focus is located in the interior of the parabola. So, next, we have a directrix, a fixed straight line. Any given point equal distance from the focus and the directrix. And lastly, we have the lattice rectum. So the lattice rectum is a cord through a focus parallel to the directrix. So take a look for this equation. So if the squared is in the x equation, it's possible that if this is positive, it opens upward. If P is negative, it opens downward. If the Y is squared, if P is positive, this equation, it opens right. If P is negative, it opens left. So in order for us to know how to graph a parabola, I have one example later on on how to graph a parabola and how to find its vertex, the focus, the rectrix, and the lattice rectum. Okay, so take a look at our example in graphing a parabola. So what we are going to do first is to look at the first variable or what is the variables that have squared. In this equation, we have x squared is equal to 12y. x is squared, meaning to say our parabola opens upward or downward. So, unable for us to know if it is upward or downward, we need to solve p. And since our p is 12, 4p is equals to 12. So we need to divide both sides 4. p is equals to 4 divided by 12 is positive 3. Because p is positive, therefore our parabola is opens upward. So next thing to do is to find the vertex. Take a look to the equation. Are there H and K here? Because since the vertex represents us the H and K. So meaning to say, our vertex will be 0, 0. We already get the P and the parabola is opens upward. So meaning to say, our focus is here. able for us to find the focus we need to move three upwards so one two three focus focus is zero and positive three so this is our vertex vertex
So, our focus is 0 and 3. We need to find the directrix. And able for us to find the directrix, we need to move we need to move three three steps downward. One, two, three. So here it is the directrix. Our directrix is zero and negative three. Zero and negative three. So meaning to say our directrix is here. We need to find the latus rectum. We all know that the latus rectum is the measurement in focus and also parallel to the directrix. Formula of latus rectum is 4P. So our 4P here is 12. So we need to divide it by 2. Have 6. So we need to move 6 in the left and 6 to the right since there's 2p both sides so 1 2 3 4 5 6 another 1 2 3 4 5 6 it is parallel to the directrix so what are we going to do is to graph our parabola get the vertex the, the focus the directrix and the latus rectum we also have a graph of parabola that's all for today's video thanks for watching